to see Caught in a landslide No escape from reality Open your eyes Look up to the skies and see <laughs> Rhymes ever made by man are going into this mic written by this hand. Are coming out of this mouth made by this tongue. I tell you now, my man, my name is Young. But so you think that this your destiny to get the best of me. But I suggest to be quiet, but don't even try from the east and west of me. Taking it and never breaking it, or even shaking it, grooving it and always moving it, cause I'm not faking it. Pulling out rhymes like books off the shelf. Born in England, makes a holler, start to go for myself. This is stone cold rhyming, no frills, no fluffs, and it's no accident that these rhymes sound tough. I'm going off, baby, there's no turning back. I'm on your TV, on your album cassette, and they track. And when the show is finally finished, I'll be taking my bath. My name is Jung and yo, I got no how. You know what I'm saying? I'm making rappers hesitant Invite me to your house And I'll be chilling like a resident Yes, cause I'm that type of man Cause I make myself at home No matter where I am
escapes you with a sound It's delineated, I'll wait it at the station for an hour But I won't make it, you take off on an uptap by the tower And you overtake it every moment But I see you on the rise, you're trying to cross the sky rolling. And wonderful set of teams from Group B. We'll talk about those teams in just a moment. But before we do, let's go ahead and draw our giveaways once again uh, from uh, RoboBits for the Robo Rollers, And that was the keyword as well, too. Robo Rollers for the intake kit. Uh, don't forget, if you do win, please go to firstupdatesnow.com slash winner in order to fill out the form uh, for that. And uh, the winner of that, speaking of this, is going to be uh, uh, Nick Solis, I believe is the way you pronounce it. Congratulations to Nick Solis. Uh, for that and let's also draw for the giveaway from our friends uh, at 2539 for the button kit and also this uh, pretty awesome t-shirt as well too 25-39 uh, was it and the winner of that is going to be camda bossy boy congratulations as well too once again make sure you go to firstupdatesnow.com slash winner in order to uh, make sure you get your giveaway for that and uh, get all that stuff as well so um, christine let's jump into group b talk about the uh, awesome teams that are part of that who you got first Yep, so coming out of Hershey, Pennsylvania, we got Team 2539, the Krypton Cougars, and I'm a huge fan of the wide, like, frame robot. They have a sweet, like, bumper floor intake that I thought was really cool, um, and I saw some elevator trap scoring already, which is pretty impressive. I think this is one of the first ones that we've seen so far tonight. Um, I'm excited to see if their speed really improves over the season, and they have a pretty solid-looking robot so far, um, but I really like the wide kind of like approach to scoring i think that's really gonna like benefit them especially during a lot of like you know high defense play um but really good looking robot so far out of krypton cougars and then after them we had the finney falcons teams 40 1405 um i really like their slick handoff and i really liked the uh like the animation of like the the way that the robot moves like it just has like kind of a personality to it also the lime green bumpers are pretty sweet um but i really like how it opens up to kind of like drop the intake down um i didn't see any like trap or hanging yet but there's still it looks like there's room for improvement or like space to add to this robot um throughout their season but i really like how that kind of like hood flaps up and the over the bumper intakes i just constantly think of like what was it? 67 from 2000 and basketball wow. season, whatever it was, but that sweet sweep drop down. Like so many teams have built off of that year after year. And it's so cool to see it like still being used now. Um, so Finney Falcons out of Rochester, New York. So we'll definitely be seeing some awesome note scoring out of them this year. Uh, after them, we had team 3494, the quadrangles quad, how do we say this? Quadrangles. Quadrangles. Yep. Out of Bloomington, Indiana. Um, I love the, this is probably one of my favorite designs out of this entire group. The kicker wheel kind of like Kitbot wheels are so cool. I love how they're multifaceted. I hope that they definitely like sell that to the judges big time. Um, but the simplicity of the manipulator is obviously super complex. It definitely seems like they did a lot of testing to get to that point, but super big fan of the quadrangles like multi-use um like intake with those little kicker wheels so kudos to them it's definitely one of my favorites from this group and rounding out the teams that i will be covering is team 22 the 2240 brute force out of denver colorado the sunshine state um, i'm a huge fan of their robot name which was was it Sabretooth? Because all I can think of is that like animal voiceover i don't know if anybody else seen it wolverine Sabretooth. if you haven't seen it go youtube it it's takes up like so much front free space in my head. Um, they were really clean looking wide intake. Um, love that they're already like tracking those April tags big time to score up into the speaker. Uh, the music that they had was really slick and I was actually doing some deep Googling on one of their sponsors, Ball Aerospace, which yes, is the same as the Ball Mason Jar manufacturer. So if you're looking for something to go learn about tonight, you can go look up information about <laughs> Ball Aerospace, which is one of their main sponsors. So uh, looking to see 
how they do this year. Uh, congratulations to how they're doing so far, though. They're at Denver, Colorado, Sunshine State. Tyler, who else do we have in this group? Yeah, one of the things I, I just love about uh, seeing teams and their current progresses, right? Because with the end of build season, everybody's in a different state, and it's just so cool to see where this is. But a team that's in really good state right now is 1741 uh, Red Alert. You know, hey, after a robot in three days and working with the Cranberry Alarm team, who is based out of Red Alert, uh, I got to say only good things right now. This is, robot is awesome uh, for this as well, too. Um, you know, I, I know they're watching right now, so hello to everybody on Cranberry Alarm and Red Alert uh, as well out there. But, you know, I'm really sad I'm not going to see this robot in action. I'm going to meet Indiana week one, and they're competing, I think, like weeks uh, three, four, and five or something like that as well, too. There's a lot of cool stuff uh, with this as well. They have taken, essentially, the Cranberry Alarm and just improved upon it and made it even better and add their own touches as well, too, which I think is great uh, with this as well. We see some really cool things. A cool little uh, funny thing at the end, uh, thinking they got the 4 auto and then it bounces back out. I appreciate that from a video uh, perspective as well. Uh, this team has a lot of blue banners, especially in Impact Awards as well, too, but some good wins. Uh, definitely be a force to reckon with here uh, in uh, the crescendo season. So good luck to uh, 1741. Next up, we have uh, Delmar, uh, who's coming in, or Dream, uh, for that. Um, I like their uh, progress showcase in their build. There's a lot of great stuff to draw uh, from here uh, that gives us a glimpse. I'm excited to see some more performance come out of this. A lot of this is uh, mostly uh, just uh, some overview of the robot. We don't get to see as much performance, but we know it will come out. They don't actually compete till week four in St. Louis, uh, so they got some time still to get where they need to go. So uh, it's a lot of cool stuff coming out of this team, and, and can't wait to see uh, even more. I appreciate some of the nice uh, shots they did in the cinematography in this as well, though, too. Next team coming up uh, after this is going to be uh, 5436 Cybercats uh, coming out of Rochester Hills, Michigan. Somebody's asking if some Michigan teams. There are definitely a few Michigan teams in here. Uh, so they had a respectable season last year, by the way, making it the uh, Fim Champs as well, too. Uh, the music made me think I was in a war movie. Uh, definitely very reminiscent of very, uh, uh, like, a long, like, c cinema cinematographic scene or something like that going through uh, on there. So looking to see how they can uh, get their climb down and potentially a harmony with this robot. There's a lot of great opportunities uh, that can come with uh, 5436 Cyber Tech, Cyber Cats. So good luck to them uh, in this as well. Uh, lastly, 7211 Hollywood. I had a chance to see this team uh, at the uh, Kettering uh, Mid mid build event and their progress so far and they just keep getting better and better uh they're definitely uh one of the best teams uh there uh is that as well so they've had some experience already with that i don't remember if they're competing tomorrow at the kettering week zero or not but even more experience under their belt potentially for that as well too uh they had a win last year at troy too so definitely a team that's really been on the up and up in michigan uh and this year's robot looks like it's gonna be really good as well too i'm curious about that end mechanism when it just kind of like shoots up and bloops on there i think that was a blooper i'm not sure uh we'll see uh, how that hey it could be their amp scoring you never know right it could be like a secondary thing for that but a lot of great things coming out of 7211 uh and i wish them best of luck in the season in a great video uh as well too so congrats to them on that 